Hi, if you're watching this video, you took your trumpet apart. You're going to tell me, I didn't take my trumpet apart, Mr. Anderson, but you did, or you wouldn't be watching this video. Uh, the reason you're watching this video is when you blow in your trumpet, it sounds like this. <gasps> that is, doesn't make any sound at all. It feels like someone has shoved a giant cork in the end of your trumpet and is plugging it all up. Don't worry, it's fixable, but you did take it apart. Just fess up. So here's what you need to do. Um, you took your valves out, and when you put it back together, you either put the valves in the wrong order, or you put them in face in the wrong direction. Let me show you how to fix it. Now, I broke this trumpet myself, so I know that the valves are just facing the wrong direction. But either way, you're going to have to unscrew all three valves. I unscrew it with this ring here, not with the top. I should pull the valves out. The first thing I'm going to do is check to make sure the number on the valve is correct. Oops, that was facing the wrong direction. You can see the number one on that valve. So the first valve goes closest to the player. It's also labeled right here on the trumpet. Hard to see in the movie, I know. So I'm going to put this valve in with the one facing towards the mouthpiece into the instrument. I can feel that it's clicked into place. I'll tighten it down. Pull this one out. Number two. Put it in facing towards the mouthpiece. Make sure it's clicked into place. Tighten the ring. Since one is there, two is there. I know this one is three. I already know it's in the right place, but I got to make sure it's facing the right direction. There's the number three. Number three is facing towards the mouthpiece. Clicked into place. Tighten the ring. So now the trumpet works properly. It was pretty easy to fix. It's even easier not to break. Make sure that you don't take your trumpet apart. If you do have to take a valve out to, to oil it, which is something that we usually do later on, not so much in sixth grade, make sure that you put it back in with the number facing towards the mouthpiece into the trumpet. Make sure it's clicked into space. Thanks for watching.